What's up, y'all? This is C. Alexander, and this is an all hip hop Atlanta exclusive. And I'm here with the one and only Trap Beckham. How you hey, doing today? <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. Vibing. You know what I'm okay. saying? So, what you been up to? I've been working. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Traveling a lot. Working on this uh, new project called Make America Shake Again. Mm -hmm. So, Ooh. that's going to be crazy. Uh, mm -hmm. I just released a new record. It's called Back It Up, featuring Flo Millie. Mm -hmm. You know, produced by Kobe Mix. That is a club record of course and um yeah man we just been banging banging our records hitting the streets i love it so yeah. i did want to before we get into all the music and everything let's uh start with your name i know that's real crazy right hey, but yeah. the first time i heard trap beckham mm -hmm. of course i thought about you know the elite soccer player david beckham right so i was like oh this right. guy gotta be dope right so <laughs> <laughs> well you know what's the inspiration behind your name um the Beckham was like something I added like in 2011, like on some uh, like Gucci Man La Flair, mm -hmm. Soulja Boy Tell Him. I was just like, Young yeah, Trap Beckham. Yeah, so, so yeah, and then I just, <laughs> I dropped the Young when I signed because I couldn't be Young Trap no more. So okay. that's how I, the Beckham stuck. But like, I just, yeah, it was, of course came from David, but uh, yeah, it was, I just thought it was cool <laughs> for okay. real. Yeah. So, Trap Beckham. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, outside of the music, who are you as a person? Like, how do you want people to know you? Um, I, I want people to know I'm cool, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, <laughs> a lot of uh, celebrities and superstars and people with the clout, they don't be mm -hmm. cool or personable, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? So that's number one. I'm super cool. You hanging out with me, I just, I like to chill, you know. I'm not okay. really that wild unless it get like that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, um, yeah, that's number one. Um, I like dope music, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? I like to travel. Um, yeah, shit, regular, regular good things. I want y'all to know the good stuff. <laughs> I like that. So, yeah. we got to talk about, what is it, uh, birthday chick. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to say the other one. One time for the <laughs> birthday chick. Yes, you have literally <laughs> started with, like, a club anthem. Yeah, it's, it's, it's an epidemic. It's an epidemic. Mm -hmm. It's crazy. We just got the numbers back, and now we, uh, we're eligible you know what I'm saying, for a gold plaque now. Wow. You know what I'm saying? So don't tell nobody, but the gold plaque coming soon. You know what I'm saying? Super soon. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm talking about it's already got. You know what I mean? But, okay. So that being said, when it was released in 2016, like, did it ever cross your mind it would have this much traction? Uh, <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah, but no. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I, I did. I knew it, but I didn't know how it was going to happen or who it, who it uh, would affect. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And how far it would go. So... Um, yeah and no, you know what I'm saying? I knew, I believed in the record, but I didn't know it was going to be, you know, part of the culture, you know no, what I'm saying? Okay. It's, it's, it's like, you know what I'm saying? It's up there with Juvie them, you know what I'm saying? It's part yeah. of the culture. It's birthday chick, you know what I'm saying? It's so, going to be a staple. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's already, it's done. So, from 2016 to now, how do you feel like you've evolved as an artist? Uh, I feel like, I feel like my songwriting abilities... Okay. Are better. And I feel like my um like now I'm producing. You okay, know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. In 2016 I wasn't producing so much. Now I'm producing a lot of my beats. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So um I I leveled up just that just picking up a whole you know what I'm saying mm -hmm. production picking up a whole another credit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So so speaking of producing, I do want to say well your song Birthday Chick was featured in. It's a raise and secure on HBO. Yeah. That's huge. <laughs> that was okay, crazy. So, yeah, how was that? Like, that was crazy. What? Was that what? Like? I got so many people. I had so many people, like, just tagging me this stuff, yeah. uh, texting me. And um, it was just, it was monumental because like, it was one of the first um, syncs, TV syncs I had. So, mm -hmm. um, and then it's HBO. So, the check was nice. Right. Um, and it's it's Ray. The show was doing yeah. great that season. So, it was it's part of a legendary season. So, mm -hmm. I was happy, man. I was just like, dog, no, that's that's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy. Right. That's crazy. And so, you know, it's just a testament of how big a record could yeah. actually get. You know what I mean? So. And this is only the beginning. Yeah, definitely only the beginning. Yes, and that being said, mm -hmm. um, you know, do you ever do you enjoy making music for just like the club scene, or do you ever want to kind of branch out one day? Or yeah, I got I got lots of vibes in my Dropbox. Okay, it's like. You know, you just got to feed the people. You That's know what I'm right. saying? You got to feed the people and you got to, you know, inch your way to that. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, like, for me, uh, I like to drop the club records because 
it's that's just like my niche. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But then outside of that, I got like, you know, some slow vibes, some island vibes, some I like yeah, I got yeah, I got some vibes in the in, okay. in the Dropbox for real. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you got your new single. Yeah. Back it up. Back it up. Flo Millie. Hey. Uh, yeah. She is from what? Mobile, Atlanta, Alabama? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, yeah. how did y'all link yeah. up? Um, my manager, TJ, had recommended it. Okay. You know what I'm saying? He had recommended that I work with her because um, I had the record. It was, of course, like what it was. You know what I'm saying? We yeah. had the open second verse and it was like, man, who would slide something like this? We thought of like Black Youngster. Mm-hmm. We thought of um, Meg. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. We was like, but nah, we need to get, we need to find somebody fresh. Okay. And um, he had mentioned Flo Millie, and I never had heard of her, so I mm-hmm. went to go check her out. Her numbers was crazy. Mm-hmm. Uh, her songs, her verses was crazy. I was like, okay, mm-hmm. let's do it. You know what I'm saying? So we linked that up. Mm-hmm. She uh sent back the verse. It was dope, right, crazy. Just like you, was you know what I'm saying? <laughs> just like I was expecting yeah. it. Uh-huh. And um. You know, it's been taking off ever since. You know what I'm saying? Especially with the Back It Up Challenge we got going on. Jump right to it. You know so what I'm saying? So how do we get a part? Like, how do we become a part of that? I mean, all you got to do is I wanna, play the record, matter, of course. Right? So, little Booty, come on now. I might, I might jump come in. Come on now. <laughs> little Booty's Matter. I don't play what she was saying. Yeah. How can people participate? Yeah. You, um, <laughs> all you got to do is uh, play Back It Up, of course. Right. Uh, make a video to it. Be creative. I don't care what you're doing. You could be just merely rocking and getting crazy, but okay, make so a video. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> but you just know it's a competition, so mm-hmm. you know you got to get crazy with it if you really want to win the two thousand dollars that we have on the line if you win. So that's real. Yeah, man, two thousand dollars to the winner. Back it up challenge. Tag me, Ooh, Trap Beckham. That's a lot of money. Yeah. Okay, so I want to ask you. Um, you know, you're an independent artist mm-hmm. now, so. How, what was the transition like, um, you know, with you being previously signed with Def Jam? Like, um, what has that been like for you? It's, it wasn't really the, too much of a difference because, okay. like, ultimately, you got to be an independent artist. Like, you know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? It's like a whole different type you of mind. Yeah, the like, when I got there, it was like, yo, dang. Like, it's not too much different. Like, you got to really still... You know what I'm saying? Do your own stuff, be your own artist, and set your own things up. You know what I'm saying? That's they right. just put the fuel to the fire. You know uh-huh. what I'm saying? They just, they help, they put you where they you need to be the, the with that. Yeah. You, right. you know what I'm saying? So, and, and they help with budgets tremendously. Okay. So, like, right. your videos and everything is crazy. Um, so, what about now? Now, it's, I, we still have like the same budget type videos okay. and stuff like that. Like my, I'm I'm to a, uh, I'm signed to an indie label. Okay. So like, my indie label is pretty dope. You know what I'm saying? I got a pretty dope setup. I got a great PR. I got a great manager. Mm-hmm. Got a great, you know what I'm saying? Investor. You got a great, yeah, anybody? yeah. The whole team, man. Whole whole multi <laughs> gang out there, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Stevie Stat. Shout out to you know what I'm saying? TJ. Mm-hmm. You know, T the Taste Maker, April Love, you know. Okay. You know, right. DJ Fat Pat, you know what I'm saying? Ricky, Pre. The list goes on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> the whole game. Okay, so you got an EP coming out. Mm hmm. Okay, so. Make what, America Shake Again. Yes, you mm-hmm. spoke on that in the beginning. So, any collaborations you want to kind of speak on? Um, I didn't have too many on them. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I mm-hmm. didn't have too many. I just, uh, I kept it light, but when. I that I, I do want to, uh, <laughs> one I do want to point out is, uh, my boy Mind Shepherd. Okay. He blessed me with a verse, one of his first verses. So, man, shout out to all the athletes out there who doing music, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? I think that's pretty dope that he wanted to get that's out there. Dope. And the record that he on is Slide, for sure. You well, know what I'm saying? Be on the lookout. Yes, yes, yes. Be on the lookout. It's coming soon.